I want to take the opportunity to thank the inhabitants of the mountain for giving us an insurmountable margin in the election. According to the IABC whistleblowers and our own internal figures, our opponents beat us all in parts of the Rift Valley. Everywhere else across the, 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 the diverse and great land, we beat them thoroughly. Hello? We know what happened next at the Supreme Court. A compromise court failed to either declare the true victors, another the elections, or order rerun because of the glaring violations of the law and the constitution by the IEBC. The Supreme Court itself was captured by the cartels that had also captured the IEBC. The two most critical institutions, two elections in Kenya, that is the IEBC and the Supreme Court, was central to the rigging of the 2022 elections. We know that the foreign technology companies contracted by the IEBC to run the elections and print the ballots was central to the rigging of the elections. That is why they and the IABC refused to provide us with the servers and the authentic data as well as the election forms. We also noticed with dismay the involvement of some foreign nations in the rigging of Kenya's 2022 elections. In light of the above, here is our clarion call. Here is our clarion call. One, first, we as a Neo reject the 2022 election result totally. We cannot and we will not recognize the Kenya Kwanza regime and we consider the Kenya Kwanza government illegitimate. Two, two, we don't recognize Mr. William Ruto as the president of Kenya. Hello? 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 We don't recognize him and we equally don't recognize any officials in office with him. Three, we demand that the entire infrastructure and the records of the 2022 elections at the IBC be made public and be audited by an impartial body. A forensic audit of the IBC results and servers is non negotiable. Four, we demand that any attempts to reconstitute the IBC single handedly by Mr. Ruto cease forthwith so that Kenyans themselves can reconstitute the body after full and fair deliberations. 